Hello, my friends on YouTube. I want, this is Box Van D, and I want to share today a video clip of how I do my dishes in my truck. And also, I decided it's a very cold, windy day, so I made a homemade chicken soup, and I show you how I did that. This afternoon, I will be sharing this meal with my friends and let you know what they thought. Thanks for watching. Hello, everyone. So, people wanted to see how I do things in my truck. I'm going to show you how I do my dishes. <coughs> I boil a pot of water a little bit on the stove in my little tea kettle. And I have a little collapsible dish rack. So, what I do is I take a paper towel and I wipe out the pans as much as I can to get as much of the food out of it as I can. Then I put a little bit of cold water in my sink, whatever I need. And then I add a little bit of just a couple drops of my dish soap. And then I add a little hot water to my dish sink. And then I wash the dishes. For like this. I just do it this. Scrub the silverware first always and the cups. Silverware and the cups first. And then they take I get my pan in there to start soaking a little bit. I take my hot water and rinse the silver with the boiling hot water. I want to make sure it's disinfected. Throw them in a little dish rack. Like that. And then I wash the rest of the dishes. So once they're all washed, then I just finish rinsing them with my hot water from my tea kettle. Just try not to waste too much water. Pour that on there. Then do this here. A little bit on the lid. Not too much. Just enough to rinse it. And then I don't worry too much about the outside of the pans, but I do worry about the inside. So if I see anything, I'll get it while the hot water is in there. So that's the, the way I do the dishes. Then I take my dish pan and I, I use the sponge and clean all my counters and the stove. I take the dish pan and I dump the water down here in my gray water bottle. I could dump it in the sink because I do have a drain. But it, then I have to clean the sink and the drain. So this is a pretty nifty little dish rack I got. It's a collapsible. I got it on Amazon. It has a little drain thing to stick over the sink if the water would fill up and dump into your dish pan. And just collapse it like that and I store it next to my gray water bottle. So that's where I keep that. Uh -huh. So today it was very cold out this morning. And I decided to have a bunch of chicken from last night had to use up. So I put it in this pot. I have a three quart saucepan. And what I did is I added the chicken and boiled it. I added some salt and pepper three or four bouillon cubes, which is here, and a uh, little garlic and a little basil. I added some green beans from, these are all my Thrive Foods, so I added green beans, I added peas, carrots, celery, and onion. So I added a half a cup of rice. And I let that all boil for about an hour 
or so just to get it all cooked up and turned out so great so what I'm gonna do is have a soup with my friends today around two o'clock we're, we're we're gonna share our meal this is a soup it came out pretty good I left the chicken whole so what I did is I just added everything oh it's a nice thick soup you can see how aromatic you can't smell it but it smells wonderful and I think I probably add a little more broth just because I want to make sure it goes around really well but it's more like a stew than a soup and this is the way I've been doing my soups for chicken soup for years chicken or turkey or even a vegetable soup beef vegetable same thing just different meat so that's how I make my homemade soup and I hope everybody will love it we're gonna get together and have a lunch a late lunch today